This should be the truth behind Nagito's trap. How about it, Chiaki? Will that help you figure out who the killer is? I don't know how it would, but... You can have a shot. Uh, um... Chiaki? Just as I thought. It's impossible, isn't it? Are you saying we just have to vote for someone? Oh, this sucks. It could be anybody. What Hajime said is... probably true. That's part of the reason why I thought it was a little strange. Did Nagito... really not care who the killer was? Wait... Wait... Oh... He said this to us earlier. Oh... No... No. I know what's coming up. One specific line. And... That feeling of belief is at the heart of his trick. He believed we'd notice the fire grenades. He believed we'd try to extinguish the flames. And he believed we'd fall into his trap. By believing in us, Nagito was able to put his life-threatening plan into effect. What do you mean, believe? And what's wrong with that? There's one more thing, remember? Something that Nagito believed in from the bottom of his heart. Here it comes. I want you to try to remember what that is. Here it comes. You've got to be kidding me. The one thing Nagito believed in besides hope itself. He believed in his ultimate luck. I see! Nagito believed in his talent as the ultimate lucky student. He relied on luck. He put all of our lives on the line just to prove that he had the ultimate luck. I guess the last thing he could believe in was his own talent. That's not so strange, really. Most of us here have been relying on the same thing. But, in his case, it was pretty remarkable, wasn't it? It almost seemed like he had blind faith in it. As if whatever he had planned would not go wrong because of his ultimate luck. You're right. The same thing happened when he cleared the final dead room at the funhouse. He had the utmost faith in his ultimate luck. That he played Russian roulette with only one bullet missing. He just... He just knew he was going to live through it because of his luck! <laughs> Played an impossible game and won. I guess his luck speaks for itself. He has relied on his luck this entire time. All this time he's been relying on his talent and it's been working for him! He shouldn't have the... Well, I guess if it's his talent, I was about to say he shouldn't have this much luck, but he does.
But his luck doesn't have anything to do with the case this time, right? Well... I just thought... It was strange that it doesn't connect to anything. If he's relying on his ultimate luck now, he wanted something from it. He factored in his belief in us. But for some reason, he didn't factor in his own luck. No, there's no way. I mean, this is Magito we're talking about. Wh what did he do? You know, he wasn't just after anybody. <gasps> he probably had a target. A target he was aiming for all along. A person to set up as the killer. And relying on his luck, he would have gotten it. A target? Who? one person he's been talking about this entire chapter. The target's true identity. Even Nagito didn't know it. That's why he relied on being the ultimate lucky student, and incorporated that luck into his plan. As long as he had his luck, he believed the target he was after would pick up the fire grenade. You mean, he left his plan to luck? Left it all to luck. He risked his life for that? He probably risked his life just so his ultimate luck could decide this. Who is it? Who's the target Nagito was after? The whole reason he put our lives in jeopardy was to weed out a traitor. I see! That's it? The traitor? Nagito was after the traitor, huh? Then he... He relied on his luck to weed out the traitor? All of that set up to weed out a traitor, and he left it to his ultimate luck! He's not even gonna be here if it works! Nagito didn't know who the traitor was until the very end. All he could do was rely on his own luck. Then... What he said in his video message... Probably true. By that point, his plan should have already been in motion. And again, he left it all to luck. To be fair, Hajime, it's kind of hard to believe. He's trying to weed out something he knows nothing about. And yet, every other time he's relied on luck, it has worked. But if he just wanted to out the traitor, he didn't have to go this far and make that person the killer. Damn it! We're all in a huge bind because of that! It means he wants us to beat the traitor. By finding out who the traitor is, our hopes will shine even brighter by overcoming that despair. That's something he'd say. Monami, it looks like you've got something you want to say. But you better just keep your mouth shut. Monami, do you know something we don't? And that concludes my argument. Nagito's plan was to make the traitor kill him. What are you going to do? Are you guys going to believe me? <laughs> it was literal blind luck! And now he's made somebody the killer! And he was very adamant in thinking that person that he unintentionally targeted was going to be the traitor, based on ultimate luck. The only thing we can do is believe. If we don't, can we just be relying on our luck when we cast our votes? But even if we do believe, what should we do? I mean, if we don't know who the target is, there's no way we can even vote. 
You are absolutely right. It is hard to think the traitor would reveal themselves now. If, by chance, the traitor revealed themselves during that bomb scare, what would have happened? It's a good question. Would it have stopped Nagito from acting so reckless? Huh? That's the only reason he went to those extremes. But they couldn't help it. Even if they wanted to reveal themselves, they couldn't do it. Because they weren't created to do that. What are you getting at? Ch Chiaki? What's wrong, Chiaki? Get a hold of yourself! That's why... I want you guys to guess. You want us to guess? Yeah, I want you to guess. What? What does that mean? Who do you think it is, Hajime? Who do you think the Future Foundation sent to infiltrate your group as the traitor? Why? A traitor who's not allowed to think that they're different from everyone else. Why? A traitor who can only interact with everyone as a traitor. Why? Because that's the nature of their existence. They can only exist as a traitor. Seriously, why? Who do you think is the traitor? Um... Hajime, please. Oh, don't look at me like that. Please don't. I... I don't want to do this. I don't want to. I... I really don't. But... We have... Some reason to suspect... Please don't hate me. It's... You? Chiaki, you're the traitor? Please! Hold on! Ah, you totally guessed right. What? Just as expected. Yep, you're correct. I'm the traitor. The agent sent by the Future Foundation to hide among you all is me. <laughs> no! Hey, Chiaki. Are you being serious right now? Ch Chiaki is the traitor? That is a lie, right? Surely you must be joking. I'm sorry. It's the truth. Hey, what are you saying sorry for? What does this mean? You... Up till now... You've been tricking us? What? We were not tricked! After all, we have been working together all this time! We have been helping each other all this time! Chiaki, being a traitor, being a member of that horrifying future foundation, that is obviously a lie! Please! Wait! The future foundation isn't what you think it is! Shut the fuck up! We're talking to Chiaki! No. I have nothing more to say. Why? Because we already know the killer's true identity. No, 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 no! So the only thing left to do is vote. No, you gotta be kidding me! H hold on! We're not satisfied yet! If you say you are the traitor, please provide an explanation that will help us understand. We cannot vote until we are satisfied. That is what you said earlier, Chiaki. 
Hey, if you're really the traitor, why'd you wait till now to reveal yourself? It's weird, isn't it? Waiting until right now to out yourself. It's definitely strange, right? Or rather, why was I able to do that? Maybe... I wanted to protect everyone, no matter the cost. Hey, Hajime. Can you do me a small favor? Yeah. F favor? Me? I want you to prove to them that I'm the traitor. Huh? What? I don't want to! Don't ask me to do the impossible, I've already done that! I don't want to do it anymore! What are you saying? Why do I have to do that? I want to explain everything to you guys, but... As I expected, that's rather difficult. That's why... The only thing I can do is plead with you. I want you to do it. I believe you can prove it. Whether I can prove it or not, that's not the problem. Don't you understand? You may as well be asking me to kill you! Please no, Chiaki, this isn't fair! I... There's no way I can do that. I'm very sorry, but this is the only way. So please... <laughs> Looks like we gotta do what we can. It's not like I believe she's the traitor. There's just no way we can ignore this without confirming it. If she was just disguised or something, this would have been a heck of a lot easier for us to understand, but... She, she's not disguised at all! Cause... Chiaki isn't the traitor! Monami? <laughs> Too bad. I'm not part of the same group as that girl. I don't know anything about that girl at all! Hey! Are you trying to cover for her like that? You suck! I've always been alone. I have no friends anywhere. That's why I have no relation to Chiaki whatsoever. Hajime, you're going to listen to my request, right? Is there a way to say no? Chiaki isn't my friend. Are you sure? I hate Chiaki so much! Are you sure? If we can prove there's a relation between the two, that'll solve it. Investigated Nagito's cottage. I discovered a notebook with a new Sami logo on it. That's your notebook, right? The one Nagito stole from you. Uh, I don't know. I don't know. Don't tell me. Is that where the traitor's true identity is written? In a manner of speaking, yes. That's right! Since I knew something like this would happen, I made sure to bring it here today. Oh, uh, so sudden? Give me that notebook! Reading through all these passages, there is one in particular that caught my attention. Recapping everything from day one up until now. Huh? What is this? 
Is this Monami's diary? Is the traitor's identity written in here? Nagito was probably looking for that too, so that might be why he stole the notebook. But you wouldn't know who the traitor is just by reading this notebook. Of course, Nagito wouldn't know either. However, it's different for me. There's something in that notebook that only I should know. You know? It took me this long, but I finally understand. Yep. Pretty much called it as soon as we got it. This isn't really Monami's notebook. It does belong to the traitor. Because the traitor also knew something that only I should have known. And now we have to call them out. First of all, this isn't Monami's diary. Apparently she can't write. Then the one who wrote this is... Someone connected to Monami. Meaning, it's not a mistake to think that the traitor wrote it. If so, is this like a report that the traitor was sending to Monami? Is it evidence that they were observing our actions and reporting to Monami? But how would you know who the traitor is from that? Because there's an entry written in here that only me and one other person would know. That topic from that day. In the fun house, I was planning on going into the final dead room. And somebody stopped me from making a mistake. Only Chiaki and I knew about the final dead room. In the notebook, there was a specific entry. There it is. It's true. I tried to go inside the final dead room. But the only one who knew that... That's right. The only person who knew that is... Chiaki. That's why Chiaki is the only person who could have possibly written about this. There must be some mistake! I mean, if Chiaki is the traitor... What was all that time we spent with her? Was that all a lie too? Miss Sonia... Chiaki is... She is being controlled by Monokuma. That is why we should help her. I I'm not satisfied either. I mean, if you were the traitor, there's no way you'd do something so stupid when we found the bomb. Now that you mention it, Chiaki immediately went to the card reader with her handbook. She tested it out right away after being told it would only react to the traitor's handbook. That doesn't make any sense. A traitor would be more cautious than that. Chiaki probably knew the bomb was a fake. That's why she also knew Nagito's trap was a bluff. She... she knew? That is a mistake! That must be a mistake! Why are you saying such things? Do you really want Chiaki to be the traitor? Of course not! But it all goes up against her! Of course not! I will not believe it! I refuse to believe Chiaki is a traitor! There is... just no way! But then nobody will be saved! Chiaki! 
Rocky is not the traitor! When we were trying to turn off the bomb, didn't Chiaki use the card reader right away? If she's a traitor, she would have been more cautious! There's no way Chiaki would have known! If that bomb was fake or not! The only person who knew it was a fake was... Me, when I tried to detonate it! Unless you know a whole lot about bombs... There's no way you know if it's fake just by looking at it! Read your truth bullets really carefully. I know you don't want to do this, because I certainly don't want to. But there is one statement that is totally a lie. Oh, man. This is terrible. And I know a lot of you Chucky were thinking that, you know, it could have been one of when two we people. A lot of people were throwing bus. Sonya under the bus because of her knowledge of weapons. Another right person away. that was being thrown under the bus was Chiaki, but a, a lot of you couldn't figure out why. But now you know. There's no way Chiaki would have known. If that bomb was fake or not. Oh, well, no, that's wrong. The only who knew it was a fake was... Here's the problem, Sonya. Me, when I tried to... That's not it. Remember who else saw the bomb was a fake. That's not it. Sonya shouldn't have been the only one who knew it was a fake. Monami was also there when you found out the bomb at the military base wasn't real. You said so yourself. Is that true, Miss Sonia? Chiaki heard about it from Monami. That's why she knew the bomb was a fake. Since I've been found out, I'll just confess. The reason I couldn't tell anyone I knew the bomb was a fake was because... If I had said that, I would have had to explain how I heard about it from Monami. I do not want to hear that! Enough already! Please do not say another word! I do not want this anymore. I am so very tired of doubting people. Sonia. And... Just because she knew the bomb was a fake, does not mean we should decide she is the traitor! Even if she knew the bomb was fake, that does not prove Chucky is the traitor! If that counts as evidence, I should be doubted too! After all, I also knew the bomb was fake! Knowing it was a fake isn't the problem. What matters is who told her. What matters is that she heard about it from Monami. There was someone other than me and Monami... ...who knew that bomb was fake! That someone is Monokuma! Monokuma said so earlier, correct? He knows everything about this island! Monokuma probably told Chiaki that it was fake beforehand! <laughs> You're right. Monokuma probably knew the bomb was a fake. But Monokuma shouldn't have told anyone either. times like this. You already know that. Uh, Hajime, are you going to believe Monokuma over Chiaki? Of course not. That's not it. It's just, even if Chiaki is the traitor, is it really okay to vote for her? 
That basically just means we have to believe in Nagito's luck, right? That's what it all boils down to. That's not it. Are you telling us to trust his luck? Are you telling us to entrust our lives to that bastard? There's no way I can believe in Nagito. I'm telling you that's not it. We shouldn't believe in Monokuma or Nagito. We have to believe in Chiaki. Huh? It doesn't matter who the traitor is. Even if Chiaki is the traitor, that's not the Chiaki I know. I believe in the Chiaki who's been with us this whole time. That Chiaki is saying she wants to protect us with her life. So the only thing we can do is believe her. If we don't, nobody's going to be saved. <laughs> Damn it. Hey, can you listen to me a little? There's nothing to be sad about, you know? Because this is different from what happened before. Unlike before, you guys don't have to stay alive by doubting someone. You guys can stay alive by believing in me. Are you telling us to believe in you and sacrifice you? That is just too cruel. I'm sorry. Ch Chihaki. Monami. I'm sorry, too. You're probably gonna get scolded by a lot of different people for this. But still, I want to protect everyone by any means. And... I'm happy that I'm able to do that. Oh, <laughs> Chiaki... It's not up to me to decide whether that's right or wrong. However, I believe it's truly amazing that you were able to think like that. We could even call this a miracle. Hey, what have you two been talking about? Everyone's jaws are dropping, you know? I know. It's voting time, right? Uh, hey, Chiaki. You don't have to worry. Believe in me, and cast your vote. God damn it! Why did it end up like this? Well, that's not the conclusion I wanted. Traitor outed herself. And all just to save us. And if we're going to go with Nakito's blind luck, then... Chiaki really is the killer. Because he outed the traitor. Well, no shit, it's not fair. One final vote. The person who killed the ultimate lucky student, Nagito Komaeda, unintentionally, based on blind luck, is the traitor, Chiaki Nanami. Even so, 